know, it's a very personal question. I want to know why a bike ride? Why? Because uh, with one statement that you make, or one tweet that you make, or just one line that you say to anybody, it just reaches out to the whole world, per se. Why would you personally want to do a ride and go to these places personally in all the conditions that you've been in? Well, the conditions, nothing wrong with the conditions. Uh, why a motorcycle? The rally for rivers, uh, when we drove, compared to this, uh, the distances that we were covering were very large. Uh, this is a much shorter ride, about thirty by hundred kilometers probably we will be doing totally. And uh, about conditions, I don't see anything wrong with the conditions. I'm talking about late seventies, when in India, roads were not really roads, and the motorcycles were not like this <laughs> The motorcycle I was riding at that time, which was a Czech model, Czech designed motorcycle, but manufactured in Mysore. So, single cylinder, 250 cc, 27 bhp, and with lots of work on it, we made it like 34, 35 bhp. Modified. Modified. But uh, today, we are riding 1230 cc, 172 bhp. So you think I'll complain about the rain? <laughs> At that time, roads were bad. Those days, it was such that, uh, you know, lights were so dim on the vehicles. Nobody would dare to drive when the monsoon rains were pouring. Trucks, cars, buses, everything would stop. I would be one lone vehicle, which would always be going through the monsoon. <laughs> because I wouldn't stop. I just loved to ride. You can barely see eight, ten feet ahead of you. But uh, so, I always rode in those conditions. So I don't find this any issue. But today, the way the roads are and the motorcycle is, no complaint at all. <laughs> now we were talking about monsoon. I just like the rain, I like sunshine. When it's very hot in summers, I went and sat on the terrace, third floor of my house, where there's no staircase for the last floor, so you have to climb up, nobody else can come. So, I burned myself simply in the sun. All the time, my mother and my father is going to ruin himself. What is he doing, frying himself up in the sun? My mother is worried that my skin will burn. I burned it as much as I can, now it doesn't burn. And less properly cooked <laughs> So one day in school, I'm in ninth standard. I got there one year earlier than I should have, so I'm thirteen years of age. So evening 4.30, school lets off. It's pouring heavy. So in the quadrangle, they're holding all the children, not letting us go. I want to get on my bicycle and go, but they're not letting us go. I like to ride in the rain. They think it's dangerous. Sun is dangerous, rain is dangerous, insects dangerous, snakes dangerous, tigers dangerous, crocodiles dangerous. Where do you live then? <laughs> So I'm just bored, they're not letting me go. So I just went and sat, there's a flag post in the center, three steps. I went and sat on one of the steps, it's pouring rain, I just sat there. Then all the teachers screaming and yelling, come, come, then the headmaster comes out and screams and yells, 
I just ignored them and sat. The roar of the rain was drowning their voices, so I simply sat in the rain, soaked. Then they sent two peons to catch me. I went up the flag, flag post and sat there. <laughs> they suspended me from school for seven days, which was a relief. <laughs> so like this, people want to grow up in an incubator all their life. So, this motorcycle is a way of opening up the minds and hearts of youth. You will see it will. Yes. It is beginning to already in Karnataka. It will go to Tamil Nadu, it will go across the country. Because uh, it's like this. A spiritual teacher, hmm, means he must be incompetent to the core, except dressing up in a fancy dress and sitting like this, he should not be able to do anything. So just breaking that mold is very important. So another reason for the motorcycle is, uh, well, we want to inspire the youth of uh, Tamil Nadu and Karnataka. A motorcycle is far more exciting for the youth than driving a car. So, motorcycle. And also I thought, we're anyway doing some important work, why can't we have some fun? I think uh, with this kind of demonstration, what we're doing right now, it's not just about Kaveri. Spiritual process will go far, very far with the youth of this nation and everywhere not just Kaveri calling. So, I thought it's time to throttle up <laughs>